He didn't enter. Yeah, he didn't enter he bracket. Did. Oh, and my man plays Dark Pit. I, I know a lot. Oh, man. Let's go. I support okay. I support this. Yep. Uh, what should Dark Pit be doing here? So, um, yo, this, so this matchup for Dark Pit, um, I mean, it's pretty standard. It's like, he has to anti-air pit, I mean, so he has anti-air shulk whenever shulk is approaching, right? And whenever he's in defense mode, you just need to camp him. Yeah, he, he just got to run away. <laughs> yeah, because a lot of shulk, um, excuse me, pits, lower percent combos won't work. Even if you do forward, if you do forward throw, you're going to be negative on throw. Really? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Negative on the field. He could have got a dash check out of that forward. Yeah. I guess when, whenever it comes to Shulk, uh, I always know some kind of plays when it comes to Minato's. Like for speed, he's, he's probably going to stay grounded, but just uh, press a lot of buttons. Mm -hmm. Oh, you press the air button a lot. Yeah, so like, just let him come to you. Because eventually with speed, he's going to come to you with it. Yeah, definitely. And with weight, you can't. And the thing about Shulk is, like, even though Shulk, yeah, he's in crack mode right now, but um, his arrows do take a long time to come out. And Pit with the frame for an air, you know, it's a good stuffing option. And the move actually connects now. So it's a pretty, you know, decent entire option. Ooh, and that arrow, ill-advised, you know, going right through Shulk, Z-axis. Oh, I thought he was going to land close I guess he's trying to stall for the time. Oh, yeah. Lost there now. Uh... So let's see, because, like, you, you could do one aerial on the opponent's shield with Buster. Still alive. Yeah. Uh, you could do one aerial on that shield, and does a lot of shield damage, and the next one's gonna poke. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Buster has a lot of shields and a lot of shield damage. Makes a lot of combos on Back here, yeah. Wow, that's strong. Yeah. Speed, yeah. Uh, yeah. I don't know what Bonham's up is doing. <laughs> He's just like... Yeah, Bonham, Bonham's up is trying to like just wait out the Monado arts, but he's not really taking advantage of waiting out the Monado arts. Yeah, you gotta like, if you, I know you can, sometimes you just wait it out, but you just gotta make a move. Like this is gonna be something that Shulk's gonna do the entire time. Use the Monados. You have to be, a little, yeah, be a little bit more proactive, because then what's gonna happen is you're gonna let um, Shulk shop, shop through his Monados, he's gonna get speed, get the defense, and just kind of camp you out and stall you out. Exactly. It's, uh, Smash, because of the jump. Oh, yeah. Just wait. It's still alive from the forest, right? Really. Yeah. Probably if you did. I probably if you did a couple combos with that. Ooh, that backslash up off the ledge. He right. wasn't aware of that. Hey, okay, what's he getting for? The down smash? No, down here. Yeah. Oh, he's trying to be for a run of a smash. Flagtail just walling him out. Ooh. He's in shield Monado right now. That's where you gotta wait. Oh, scary. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Great recovery by bottoms up. Wow, I'm surprised he evaded that, too. That would do it. Oh, yeah. In Smash Monado, you're, you're just a bad player. Yeah. Okay. Regrip. Yeah, that back air yeah. is safe in Buster mode. Yeah, yeah oh, you that would do it, yeah. It's, you gotta think of it like pit, cause, like the pits, they always go for a forward throw for the kill. Mm -hmm. And it's like with uh, Shulk with Smash Art, it's gonna go with the same thing too. Hey, yeah. they can play. Yeah, and then, you know, think, think about it right now, it's like Bottoms Up is playing a little bit more reserved, he's trying to pick his spots, but he's not really picking any spots. And he's just letting Flag Tilt kind of do whatever he wants to. His disadvantage in landing is really bad too. Yeah. He's using all of his jumps. Ooh, oh my goodness, yeah. that actually hit him. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Interesting. I've got a good yeah. that, that hit so far off stage. Did you, did, did you see his face? Did you no. see Bonito's face? No. That was a look of disgust. He was shook that was about a look that. at look at the like, wow, rejection. That hit me. <laughs> That's on the replay from that. Oh my god. Yo, yo, can we get the replay of uh Bottoms up face. <laughs> Can you please? Was it during the kill? Yes. yes. All right. Yeah, I got you. Just look, just look at his face. All right, I can make it back. I can make it. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> 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 He's like, what is this? <laughs> what is happening right now? I should have just stayed home tonight. It was raining. <laughs> I, I think I should have too. Like almost the rain just told me not just to stay home. But then I have an umbrella on me. Well, I, mean, I hopped on the train. Even with the umbrella, I was kind of thinking, like, nah, maybe no, maybe I should I don't just. Know when I just don't like going out when the rain is out. Because no matter what, I'm still going to get wet with the umbrella on. 
It's just the amount of rain. Like, it was a ridiculous amount of rain. Like, this isn't, like, this rain isn't, like, that big of a deal. It's just, I'm used to it by now. You say that until you're... Like, I'm in Florida. So it's like your the hurricanes Florida. come through. Oh yeah, where you got Florida? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I got the Florida weather on standby. I already mean, know. I already adapted to this. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You adapt to the bad times. <laughs> I learned. <laughs> All right, we're going on Unova at this time, and we're gonna have to change the skin or the same skin. Okay. Yeah. We got a siesta pit. Dark. Okay. Um. Yeah. Get that narrow out of shield. All right. Good start off for bottom drop. That's not an air out of shield. Okay, yeah, looking like he's being a little bit more proactive now. Yeah, this is actually a good start for him. Yeah. Okay. Uh, that was kind of bad on shield. Yeah, okay, out of shield. Nice. Right, so he's not anything like uh, Black Tail. It's just uh, doing a lot of aerials in neutral, and then Bomb Swift is an arrow at him. Stop that. Yeah, you know, um, it is good to use your, use your projectile, you know. It, it Dark pits. Nice. So a lot from that. Is it back? Ooh. Yeah, yeah good, aggr good aggressive um, defensive option that we got from bottom zone. Yeah, I could also air dodge into uh, into that. Yeah, the patience. Yeah, trying to get the air to that back air spaced by a uh, shell Ooh, kiss. the parry! Oh, no. That was smart. That was smart, actually. Wow. He could probably could have got force smash also. Like, he probably didn't even need to switch to smash battle. That was just to ensure the stop. Uh, yeah. You're right about that. I right, know. From that, yeah. like, he made a combat from that, too. Yeah, and right now, Flagtail's just walling him out, you know, just scaring him with his big hitboxes. Not really doing a lot. None of them actually just want to approach. <laughs> yeah. And the thing about it is it's like sometimes airily approaching Shulk isn't the, probably the best idea because Shulk has probably bigger hitbox than anybody else in the game. <laughs> so yeah. well, I'm smash out of shield at him. Got the scoop. And then kill. He has no shield, so he should take advantage of this. Yeah, he seems to so. Yeah, nice. Flat tail, good way on that. Oh yeah. And great and great low recovery coming up from bottoms up. Yeah, he knew he was going to do edge guarding with the up D. Yeah. Up throw? Okay, good option instead of using the forward throw. Because you don't want to sell out your forward throw. Ooh. Oh, it does going to be in the shield. Back throw. Probably could have dashed that. Oh, the yeah. snipe. Yeah, got the arrow snipe. Dark Pit has pretty strong arrows. Ooh, oh. and that up smash read. He still had flexibility when he did that. Oh, it just went straight forward. Oh, yeah. Uh, I, I knew it was going to be a bad option to just go uh, aggressive on a uh, shot to smash art. Yeah. You get clipped by random stuff. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah, he's going to fall out of that. That's so sad, too, because, like, once it pits, like, has aerials, or mostly hit aerials, right? Yeah. In air and forward air. Especially in the middle of that, you're going to. He's going to be too happy for that. Down throw to oh, yeah, there. he did. Uh, he did. He missed his confirm. Right now, he's above Shulk. See how he lands. Yeah, it's going to be spamming on that shield. And Flagtail's positioning has been so good, uh, especially in this game, too. Right? Because, you know, Bottoms Up had that quick start. And ever since still, Flagtail got the first stock and just ha did not let, did not relinquish that lead at all. Yeah, he didn't want... He's not letting him play the game at all. <laughs> uh... You want to... Okay, up throw for. Okay, and he's really just scaring him with positioning, really. Yeah, he's bold move, but definitely gonna be red that uh, pull in. Oof. I can do it here. Run up forward. Yeah. So, I was gonna do it, yep. Alright, with that, flat tail moves on. Yeah, that space back air is plus like that. So, um, at max range, you kind of just have to hold that and shoot, see what Shulk does. Dude, look, even if you parry uh, a perfectly spaced back air from Shulk, you can't even punish that. Yeah, you can't do anything you about can't. that. You, you need to hold that. Yeah. <laughs> you, you just need to hold that. Like, oh, yeah, the parry. I'm going to punish it. Nope. <laughs> like, it, Remember how like it was just dealing with Smash 4 cloud back air at the yeah. ledge? Yeah. kind of just have to hold you, that. You, you actually, yeah, you, you even perfect killed it, and you still like had to respect that. Yeah, you have to hold that. Same situation. You just have to hold it no matter what parry or anything. This is actually the same exact setup as Smash 4 Cloud is uh, back air. You're going to move out of shield forward till it's stupid. <laughs> 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 so, um, yeah, good stuff by um, Flagtail. 
Alright, yeah. now we're gonna have on. Uh, yeah, I next. saw Vinny up, Vinny up next on the oh, deck. Vinny? Yeah. I'm not sure who's gonna pony this though. Mm. No. But what do we have next for the ads? Uh, yo, let's get some ads out here. Uh, so, if you recently just subscribed uh, House 3000, which you should do it, um, you're gonna see some of these emotes. Um, this is made, this is by Fun Size Mini. She does commissions, art raffles, Twitch emotes and badges. Um, so pretty much all these emotes that you see on the Hash 3000 stream, they're made by Fun Size Mini. So you can follow her on Twitter at it's Fun Size Mini, Instagram, Facebook, and whatever's left of Tumblr. So um, it's a Pikachu <laughs> surprise. <laughs> yeah, she, she, <laughs> God, she does a surprise. <laughs> Definitely like give that. her money. Okay, <laughs> do it for the culture. Uh, what else we got here? Um, Oh, the Forge. Forge. Oh, coming up. Uh, the okay, end of up, August. Coming, coming the end of August. very last day of August. Okay. <laughs> last day of August, yeah. Um, yeah, definitely. Uh, you can pre reg for the Forge now. Um, you could, and it's going to be on Mash Hand Gaming. Follow them on YouTube and Twitch. It's at Helix Esports. Uh, that was the same venue that they held uh, Suplex City. If oh, you're, is if you're it? not familiar, yeah. Uh, okay, cool. Yeah. Great, great venue. Really good venue. Um, easily accessible if you're in the New York, and, uh, New York area. Uh, you can take the bus right over. It's literally a 15-minute bus ride from Penn Station. So. Also, oh, that would mean like uh, they're gonna host up the uh, what was it? The Tri-State Circuit thing at yeah. that place. Yeah. yeah. So it's at um, 3505 Bergen Turnpike in North North uh, Bergen, New Jersey. So definitely come through if you're in the Tri-State area. Next we got Platinum Star Arcadian. It's an Arcadian, which means unranked Jersey players only for singles. But the PR players could enter in doubles with an unranked teammate. Wait, only Jersey players can enter this? Uh, par probably not. It just says unranked NJ players only. Uh, well, I guess unranked Jersey players only, unless wow. you can like disguise your face as someone as someone new and then rig the whole bracket. Yeah, I could. I, could <laughs> pr I have proof that I live in Jersey now. Yeah, uh, you could do that too. <laughs> you get a mailing address from Jersey and walk in with it. What are you gonna tell me? Um, and also, there's a pop bonus too. Oh, and wait, and the oh wait. my god! Wait, wait, no, 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 no! I can't do, do you see that? Wait, no, no, no! Uh, winners oh, get free entry, featuring 4,000 pop bonus. Battle for the East. That's that's an Alliance City Battle for the East. Yeah, that's for their pop. That's in October. I'm pretty sure it's not the 